Hi, Julie Jules Cruise Companion. Today I am at the Dead Sea. Suwaima. With a barmy 18 degrees. So I've got my cozy on and I've got my reef shoes and I'm going to catch a little shuttle bus that leaves half an hour from the hotel which takes you down almost six, seven hundred meters to the, the Dead Sea beach. The Dead Sea is reducing, is getting smaller. So uh, every year the beach gets a little further away. Um, the temperature now, as I say, is 18 degrees. So it was one to six degrees in Amman, which is about 50 kilometers away. Um, now, ooh, it's beautiful. I have to put some sunscreen on. It's really important when you come to the Dead Sea to remember to bring something like reef shoes or some thongs, flip-flops that you don't mind destroying because of the salt content. Um, reef shoes will just assist your feet as you're walking into the water because the salt crystals are really big. <laughs> the other thing I'm not looking forward to is I have... Uh, I have a break underneath my ring. I have some blisters, chemical burns from a, um, yeah, I was using some cleaning equipment, cleaning stuff that has clearly made me irritated my skin. So that's going to be a little uncomfortable. Any break in skin integrity is going to uh, be really uncomfortable in the 34% salinity. So I'm at the Ramada Dead Sea Resort and I am going to head down to the Dead Sea. Um, I didn't have to bring a towel because I knew, because I've stayed here before, that towels were complimentary. So at reception, you're given your token for your towel and you'll go to this little booth just here, collect your towel and go down and wait for the little bus, which goes every half an hour down to the beach. So I've collected my towel using my token. I can use it either here at the pool or down at the beach. What you doing, Julie? Waiting at the bus stop. What you waiting at the bus stop for? A little shuttle to go down to the Dead Sea. Every half an hour at the Ramada Dead Sea Resort. <laughs> I'm gonna float. My flubbly lovely is going to be floating in that 34% salinity. <laughs> And it's probably going to be really uncomfortable because I have a couple of cuts, so <laughs> I'll have to uh, be brave. Be brave! So the little van has dropped me off. <laughs> Whether I'll get into the water or not, everybody seems to be coming back dry. <laughs> Just have to walk this extra little bit down to the water. The last time I was here, I can remember these very rudimentary shower facilities were quite a close enough distance from the water. But now they're over a hundred meters or so. confronting but this is me dressed in the Dead Sea <laughs> so I have used the complimentary Dead Sea mud I have spoken to the lovely French ladies and they've allowed me to sit with them and the lovely Jordanian family by the water there are all pharmacists and mother is very proud of that <laughs> she's introduced me to every one of the pharmacists in her family so I will sit and toast a while, let it dry. I have walked into the water and it is a little bit cool, but I'm here, I've got to do it.
unfortunately, these ladies are discovering the hard way that you actually do need to wear something on your feet. The rocks and the crystals are just so painful on your feet. So this is Julie Jules Cruise Companion at the Dead Sea. I keep saying that it's 34% salinity, but I think the sign said it was 31 point something. So I put my uh, Dead Sea mud on and left it on for the obligatory 10 minutes. I think I've removed most of it. I took the face off during um, with the regular water and then went into the Dead Sea to take the rest of it off. Absolutely fabulous. So Jordan's open, come on down, visit for three days, five days, ten days, it doesn't matter as long as you come to visit. Um, the three day visit would be the big ones, Wadi Rum, Petra, the Dead Sea. Four or five days you'll add a couple of extras like Umkais, Ajaloon or Jarash. Five, six, seven days you would end up with Aqaba and the Eastern Desert, the Desert Castles, absolutely fabulous. The longer you're here, the more you can do those smaller, more personal sites. Hiring a driver will also add to the personal um, experience that we, you will have in Jordan because you can have a personalised itinerary just for you. So this is Jules, Jules Cruise Companion saying, come on down, Jordan's open. Stay safe everybody and happy travels.